pee cup? What the hell is a pee cup? Right here. Hey, this is about a peacock. <laughs> What's up, guys? <laughs> oh my God. You're not showing this. <laughs> I just had a great idea for an awesome video. Please tell me this is not a video about peeing in the pool. You do. I, I do not pee in the yes, pool. Yes, you do. <laughs> no, I do not pee yes, in the pool. Yes, you do. <laughs> Dude, really? I know it sounds ridiculous. We're talking about a flipping peacock, really. Who's gonna make a video about that? Uh, I guess somebody's got a great idea, you know? They get the idea. They don't have to have a play-by-play -play of somebody peeing in a cup. I'm Lulu, and I'm Marty. And this is Manny Puig. I am Joey Diaz from Jfish Miami. <laughs> Your day is not complete unless you have a hat like this, which I can't believe I'm wearing this. Oh man, come on. You behind me crazy over here, cuz. And we are Sea Junkies Miami. This is Captain J Rod. This is Ariel from Miami Living 305. To the Slippery Beast Aviation Fishing Show. From Keys Boating Channel. What's going on, guys? You're watching Two Bears Outdoors. And you're watching Two Bears Outdoors. Two Bears. Two Bears. Two Bears Outdoors. And we love two bears outdoors. Western Diamondback right here. <laughs> An alligator. Hey guys, so I have no idea why Gus wants to do a video on this topic. But here we are. Voila. So we're talking about having a designated pee cup on the boat. <coughs> no! But we're going to ask some of our friends and let's see if any of them have a designated pee cup and see kind of what their ideas and their etiquette is. Pee cup, what pee cup? You got the whole ocean out there, you know? <laughs> My designated cup here at the sandbar. Is that your designated cup? No, you're swimming in it. Gus, my boy, this is my designated cup. Pee and poo cup slash bucket. Who really pees in a cup nowadays? That's what I want to know. Who? <laughs> you can pee in your wetsuit and water, whatever you want, but I don't, I don't see the deal with a pee cup this, you know. All day. It's got cafe con leche in it, see? to be used as my pee cup. <coughs> and then after that, it's going to be used as our bait cup. But we're not going to show you those two parts that, you know, come on. Alright, I want to know what the sea junkies have to say about this. Hey guys, so we do not have a designated cup. We have a fully functional electric toilet in our boat, so you know that's kind of how we do it so with that being said we are sea junkies miami and we love two bears outdoors Mwah. the reason we do this is because our boat doesn't have a head on it um we do have a little portable toilet this is a pain in the butt <laughs> we don't have room for this but it's heavy and it's hard to kind of get in and out but sometimes it's towards the end of the day or whatever and you've already dried off you don't want to get wet again so you're not going to get back in the water so then now there's your dilemma you've got to pee yeah, so bad. I, I really have to go potty i'm gonna go pee pee mm -hmm. so we had to figure out something so that being said it's a little bit easier for the guys to go than it is for us ladies. So of course, you know, they can just hang over the side, go to the bow. Put that little thing away. Nobody wants to see that. <laughs> <laughs> we don't really have that option. So we have to come up with other choices. <laughs> Do not video me. 
take the camera and go. So our next point would actually be there is pee cup etiquette. To pee or not to pee. Who really pees in a cup? That is the question. Did he just recite Shakespeare? Honey, this is for documentary. I don't care. Document your own self taking a leak. What are you using? What are you using? <laughs> so, I know it sounds ridiculous we're talking about a flipping pee cup, really, you know. But, um, a lot of times we're in areas that are pretty desolate, but people always show up. Everywhere we go, somebody's going to show up, and they're usually going to anchor close to us. And a lot of times, the places that we go to, you've got families around, children. So, it's just not the proper thing to do. Mommy, my neighbor! Turn me on, turn me ah! party don't stop. So it's raining. <laughs> I got kids, man. I can't be whooping out the Johnson. And I ain't talking about the engine. I think that's what people think. To pee out in front of everybody, in front of the kids, in front of everybody. That's a no-go. Wow. You know beatboxes? No. People make like music with their mouth. That's why it's called beatbox. Woohoo! Hey Dirty South, drop us a beat. fishing couple koozie you know dan and i we're the best fishing couple in uh, all the keys you know i think that's what people think i do think that's what people think people have a cue yeah. yep okay so now let's talk about the cup your cup needs to be unique i hear the ocean it needs to be like none of the other cups that you or your guests are drinking out of. You can imagine why. So nobody else drinks anything out of it? It don't even gotta be a cup. You could use a bag. Okay. I peed in that. Oh my God, Ghost, really? No, you did not, it's tea. Guys, the great thing about this when you're on the boat, you could be discreet about it. And what we like to use is, it was a water bottle that we had a bigger water bottle, not just these little small ones. And then cut the top off of it. Is to use a clear one. And that way you can see what's in it. You can see if there's anything in it. Because there's times, sometimes when, you know, if it's not clear, you may go to grab it and think that it's empty and sometimes we grab something and pew, it's raining pee. <laughs> All right, guys, I hope you found this useful and entertaining. That's basically what it was supposed to be. But uh, nevertheless, uh, you know, we're very discreet about how we do things, especially when we're around the general public. You know, we're, we just try to show common courtesy and respect to those around us. So anyways, guys, I want to give a huge shout out to my friends who are a big part of this video. Folks, it would have never been the same without you. Thank you so much. And guys, till the next time, you're watching Two Bears Outdoors. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you all later. Bye.